Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Lisa Monison, independent sales rep with Avon and national leader of the Avon Team Moneymakers. I wanna welcome you to my channel. If this is the first time you're here, thanks for stopping by. And if you are a frequent subscriber, I know you probably haven't seen me in a while. Uh, I was dealing with uh, some health issues. You may have seen the other playlist on this channel uh, in regards to that, but I am going to be doing my best to get back to some of these training videos. So thanks for coming back. And for new subscribers, I do lots of training videos, uh, beauty hauls, as well as uh, you know just Avon informational videos. So thanks for joining us. So today we are going to go over a little bit of some of the new things that are on Avon now that you may uh, be a little confused about where to find. Uh, we are finding that uh, with the new changes, a lot of people are like, I have no idea where this is or where that is. So today's focus is going to be on the fundraising tab. So stay tuned. Okay, so once you're at Avon now, which is formerly youravon.com, you can go to either one, it will still work. But avonnow.com is right up here at the top and you just type it in your address bar and you will get your sign in page. You're going to go ahead and sign in and once you are in, normally the fundraising tab and a lot of the other tabs were up here at the top. You are going to scroll to the very bottom of your screen. You'll see the beauty buzz there. And down here at the bottom is where you can find sales incentives and all these other great tabs that used to be up towards the top. So you're going to go over to the right where it says Avon Fundraising and click on that tab. And here you're going to find everything you need to get started. So let's do a mock sign up of a online fundraiser so you'll know how to do it. So you'll hit get started. And we're going to go ahead and register one. So we're just going to make one up. Okay, so we're just going to put test in here because we're doing a test fundraiser. Okay, and we'll just put my name. And we will just use my zip code and we'll just make it be a fake one. Lisa, three, four, five, seven, 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 I don't know. We'll make up a bunch of numbers so that it's not a real one. Um, and uh, about the fundraiser. So here you can type a little bit. Let's say you're doing something for the local fire department or a certain charitable uh, cause that has you know their own thing that they want to write. You would just copy, paste, stick it right there as to what they're trying to uh, raise. Uh, zero to 800 characters is available there. Put the chairperson's name. Start date and end date. So we'll just put today, 610. We'll put uh, approximately two weeks is what most people do. We'll put through the 24th. In category, you can have it set up to show up on a certain page. So let's say you want to really focus on full, more of the full earnings items, then you may not want to be clicking the fashion page. Uh, you may want to stick, or you're doing health and wellness, and that's where you want people to go. Maybe it's for a gym. You know, or something like that, trying to raise money, or if it's for school, maybe they've talked to Bug Guard, so you can choose Bug Guard. You can upload a photo uh, for your fundraiser. So let's see what image I'll just put any kind of, I'll just put a welcome to the crew. Okay, so just so you can see if it'll allow it. If it's too small or too big, it will continually say, um, there, it just did something. Okay, so save changes. Um, provided me to use their, um, you have to check that off for the, organization providing you to use their image. So if they have a spe special logo image for their business, you would put it here. Avon fundraiser, we're gonna put Lisa, one, two, three, 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 three whatever, test. So if it's, uh, like I said, the Clay County Fire Department, let's say, it would be avon.com slash fundraiser slash Clay County Fire or something like that. So you would put that there. The link is optional, but I think it's really important that you put your organization there because that is where people are going to click through. So we're gonna hit submit. These fields are mandatory. Okay, I missed something. Let's make a phone number. Okay, we're just gonna put any um, organization's goal. Let's just put a hundred bucks right now. Beauty and jewelry, you decide how much. So remember, like beauty and jewelry, you can earn up to 50% if your fundraiser is over 1575. Um, I usually give online um, on those items, it could be 20 to 30% depending on your earnings level. I'm just gonna say 20% and fashion and home, we're gonna put 15%, okay? You make a decision with them, you decide. Okay, and let's see, it is registered. So now you have this link right here. That is what would be forwarded out and we'll show you what it looks like. So now let's say you wanna send an email. 
uh, to Lisa, whatever, this is not going to go anywhere. And it says, congrats, your fundraiser is now registered. You can have an exclusive Avon online uh, store with Clay Fire Department, whatever it happens to be. Supporters of Clay Fire Department can shop to raise money. So it's already prefab for you. So easy with the goal. Okay. Just paste the link below. It tells them what to do to get any you hit send email. Okay. So that part is done for you. So easy. Then um, view all fundraisers. This is for your end of it. So this is where you can see your active fundraisers and any upcoming and any that have ended. Okay. So details, you click on that, deactivate, which we'll be deactivating this as a fake one, view details, okay? I can go back to it, and here on this page, you're gonna see how many customers, how much were sold in beauty and jewelry, fashion and home, and the total sales, and all that good stuff. Um, and then they're able, you're able to tell them how they're doing now. When we go to the link, we're gonna go to the link, so you can see what it looks like. This is a live link right now, which nobody's gonna find unless, you know, you guys all hit it, which is gonna, it's gonna disappear. So organization name, organization picture, about the organization, and here is a little tracker that will light up as it's, it's reaching the $100, okay? So people can see how many days are left, and it is live, okay? So to shop, um, it has, of course me, because I was on there, but anyway, this is going to El Monte. So you can see up here, it's still going to me, so all the captured, uh, customers will come back for repeat purchases hopefully after the fundraiser uh, they're, I'm bringing them into the store so it could be repeat business for me hopefully and uh, in the meantime all these customers you know are being generated by a bunch of other people that are trying to raise money for the Clay fire department we're just saying okay so they can shop it just like the regular store once they shop this fundraiser so it's gonna say you're about to leave fundraiser. do you want to keep shopping this fundraiser shop this fundraiser so the people will have to click that and it will always state once we get there here it's processing okay you are shopping with Lisa Monson but it knows that you're in the fundraiser see up here it says you are shopping to support the test fundraiser you can drop down okay so it makes sure that that customer is there so you can always do uh, you can always share this video with your uh, group if it helps you, um, you or with your team to teach them how it's going to look because a lot of people want to know how is it going to look what does it look like online and uh, this makes it really easy and they do the same shopping so they shop now they click their products they put it in the bag and those customers can shop anywhere in the Avon in the USA uh, Avon USA and all the products you know you don't have to deal with it as a representative it goes straight to those people's houses they pay for it the money goes into your account, and again, you can go back to your home page under your details of the fundraiser and see what the total earnings are because it's already calculated for you that you've said that on beauty and you know jewelry and stuff, you're giving back this amount, and on the fashion home, you're giving back this amount, so you will know exactly. The earnings are deposited either into your direct deposit that you've set up um, you know, regularly, so you need to keep track of that as the representative, and your... Um, your earnings go there and so make sure you're not spending the earnings for the fundraiser make sure that you know whatever you're seeing here you are keeping it separate and uh, then at the end of the fundraiser you know whatever you've agreed to you um, send over to the fundraiser people so it's, it's that simple guys so I'm gonna deactivate this one just wanted you to see how it works so you go back to my online fundraising upcoming active ended okay click details deactivate fundraiser yes deactivate okay, so now that link is gone so I hope this is helpful to you I hope you will maybe even give yourself a little test one so you can see how simple it is but I wanted to show you how easy online fundraising can be and um, just how easy it is to set up the link don't forget under fundraising you can go there and of course get all the letters and everything you need down below if you're doing online fundraiser it's here but you still may need all the letters to agree with the fundraiser whether it be online or not i highly recommend that you still scroll through this section and get all of the information that you need uh, agreement forms and what for um, the people that you're working with so make sure you're doing that the details again are here online fundraising explains a little bit more about online fundraising here but all those agreement forms let's see so i've been in here before Let's go back down to the bottom, help your community, um, FAQs, online fundraiser, let's see if it's here, reaching out, here we go. So when you go to online fundraiser, 
get bookmarks, flyers, social posts, introductory letter, a phone script. So if you don't know what to say, it tells you exactly the earnings charts, timing, persistence, prizes that you can donate. So all of these letters you can use for online and in local. But today I wanted to show you how simple it is to set up your online fundraiser. I hope you found this video enjoyable and uh, coachable for you and that you learned something today and if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up and like and subscribe this channel if you're not already subscribed thanks for watching and i hope you have a fabulous avon day we'll see you guys soon Bye bye